The medals ceremony for team figure skating is postponed on short notice amid an inquiry. Lindsay Jacobellis earns redemption in snowboard cross, and the first U.S. gold, while Sean White and Chloe Kim qualify for the half pipe finals. Follow our latest coverage of the women's half pipe snowboarding and our live coverage of men's figure skating at the 2022 Winter Olympics. It was a heartbreaking end, Michaela Schifrin's second early exit from an Olympic race in three days. But Schifrin was not ready to move on. Not just yet. Frustrated and bewildered by a Beijing Olympics dream going wrong in real time, Schifrin sat down in the snow next to the slalom course on Wednesday morning and buried her head between her bent knees. She remained there for more than 20 minutes as some of her rivals whizzed past, lost in her thoughts and her disappointment and trying to figure out what had gone wrong. When she finally came down the hill, Schifrin didn't have answers. I had the intention to do my best skiing and my quickest turns, Schifrin told reporters, fighting back tears. But in order to do that, I had to push the line, the tactics. And it is really on the limit then. And things happen so fast that there was really not space to slip up, even a little bit. Nothing in Schifrin's professional career portended the series of quick, complete disappointments she is enduring this week on her sport's biggest stage. Slalom is ski racing's most dauntingly precise discipline, but for Schifrin, a two-time Olympic champion and the most decorated slalom skier in history, to last only five seconds in her best event was almost unfathomable. As Schifrin wiped away tears on live television, friends and strangers rallied to her side. Her boyfriend, the Norwegian skiing star Alexander Amot Kilda, posted a supportive message on Instagram alongside an image of Schifrin sitting alone in the snow. When you look at this picture you can make up so many statements, meanings and thoughts, he wrote. Most of you probably look at it saying, she has lost it, she can't handle the pressure or what happened? Dot which makes me frustrated, because all I see is a top athlete doing what a top athlete does. It's a part of the game and it happens. The gymnast Simone Biles, who withdrew from several events in last summer's Tokyo Games because of a mental block that prevented her from competing safely, offered three white hearts on Twitter. Schifrin has three Olympic races left if she chooses to enter them, something that no longer seems a certainty. I will try to reset again and maybe try to reset better this time, she said. But I also don't know how to do it better, because I just don't. I've never been in this position before, and I don't know how to handle it. If I am going to ski out on the fifth gate, well, what's the point?